Hi soccer players, Coach David here from Milwaukee Scores, and welcome to this week's Scores at Home Soccer Session. We have a really fun activity for today, so let's get started like we always do with some warm-ups. So the first warm-up we're going to do is just simple heel raises, okay? So line up your feet with your shoulders, and we're just going to lift it up on our tippy toes, okay? We're going to do this 10 times, all right? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, try and hold it for as long as you can, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. So our next one we're going to jump into is called high knees, all right? Exactly. We've actually done this one before. So we're just going to lift both our knees up to our hands, and we're going to do this for ten seconds, okay? All right, here we go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. So the last one we're gonna jump into is just jumping jacks, okay? We're gonna do ten of those, alright? So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. So with our warm-ups out of the way, we're gonna jump into our body weight exercise. Um, what we're gonna do for our body weight exercise are lunges, all right? So I'll show you what that looks like. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna lean forward and bend with one knee, okay? We're gonna focus on one foot each time, all right? So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. Now we're going to do the other four. Okay? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Nice job. Good warm up and good body weight exercise. Now that our warm up and body weight exercise is done, we're going to jump into our soccer activity for today, and that's called soccer bocce ball. What you're going to need for this is you're going to need a separate ball. I have a basketball. This is going to be called the set ball, okay? You want to place it on a can or something where it's going to sit still, and if you hit it, it won't go flying, okay? And you're going to grab your soccer balls and what you're going to try and do is you're going to try and pass as close to the set ball as possible okay um you can do this by yourself with multiple soccer balls or you can get a partner um and you can try and see who can get closest to the set ball okay so i'll show you those so remember when we pass with the soccer ball we use the inside of our foot and we have our whole body face to where we want to pass okay so we we'll start off See, that's really close. I wasn't able to knock the ball off either. Try again. That went a little more off. And that one the furthest, okay? So this is gonna really help on your accuracy, accuracy and focus on where you wanna pass. But the thing is, you can also use this game uh, to practice your throw-ins, okay? I'll grab two. After a few rounds of playing with just passing the ball with your foot, you can actually try switching to practice your throw-ins, okay? So remember, we use two hands and put them over our head, and you do the exact same thing. You want to try and get as close to the set ball as possible, okay? So I'm gonna try. Now remember, soccer balls are going to roll, and you want to pass to where your teammates' feet are going to be, okay? So, light pass, bounce a few times, pretty close. Try one more time, hands over your head, a little further off, right? So, using a teammate or by yourself, try and see how close you can get to the set ball, okay? So, it's going to work on a lot of things, and you can switch it up to make things a little bit harder. You can move back and move where the set ball is, okay? But with that said, that's our warm-up for today. I hope you were able to have some fun and really focus on uh, improving on your passing and your throwings. Can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye!